ever since I was a little kid, I was very interested in natural areas. I loved going hiking and camping, and, and I was very interested in the landscape around me. I like being a scientist because I get to come out here and really look at the world in, in detail and try to figure out what's happening here. What has happened here? Why are these stumps out in the middle of the lake? I didn't necessarily think at the time when I was a freshman in college taking my first geology class that this would be something I would do for the rest of my life, but the more I got into it, the more excited I, I was about it. Just around the same time that I was deciding to go to graduate school, I also had the chance to live out one of my childhood dreams, which was to hike the Appalachian Trail from Maine to Georgia. As I was doing this, there was a lot of coverage in the news about the idea that perhaps climate was changing. It was, of course, a beautiful landscape to hike through, but I also noticed that there were things changing. You could see places where, in the White Mountains in New Hampshire, where there had previously been large snow fields that have melted away in the last few decades, perhaps in part related to climate change. And so this really piqued my interest that it would be interesting to see if you could look at geologic records of Earth's history and see how has climate changed in the past. I'm Brian Schumann. I'm an assistant professor at the University of Minnesota.